Hello Lowell, I'm gonna drive a few rounds in GP bikes because lately I've been getting into this sim racing thing and uh, yeah this simulation right here is really nice as you can see very nice Yamaha and uh, the track is mountain so what I've done is um, I'm driving this with wheel and pedals right works perfectly fine for me um, and I've seen that there's bike controls I'm trying to get one but one thing at a time right uh, because I just got a VR oculus um, DK2, a very old headset, got it very cheap, uh, use, use one right, to just try out how that shit works and um, I've set it up so uh, basically I can lean right, so let me see if I can find that real quick, so what I can do is I can, uh, for example, if I drive a little, you can see right here, right now I'm leaning to my left, leaning to the right, and you can also go front, back to uh, distribute the, uh, the weight of the rider differently, right? Interesting, interesting stuff with the controls. <laughs> I really enjoy that. So, yeah, I've been trying to get at least a little bit decent at this, and it's very, very difficult. So, I'm gonna drive this this lap right here and see. I maybe can get a little quicker and the uh, first time I drove around here I was very distracted by this uh, transparent rock right here for some reason some textures are a little bit transparent um, and GP, uh, GP bike seems to be more of an engine than a game kind of like with the official license which is uh, around 30 euros I think you only get one track and one bike but also the uh, option to mod and to go on to multiplayer which is available it's a little hard to set up apparently but it is available and I've been driving in it I'm terrible and there's a lot of guys who go quick really quick but yeah as time goes by I might get better at it at least I'm trying <laughs> and this this bike for example right here is a mod it's not the stock bike and the track, of course, as I mentioned, is a mod as well. And there's many, many different ones, um, different qualities. Like, for example, Macau or Brands Hatch, very, very well done. Um, this one right here has a few issues, but I really like the track. It's really well done as well in, in that sense. Um, I've been practicing it a little bit. <laughs> this game is so, so difficult not even funny like when I first started it I've been trying to get it to work with a controller and it was an impossible for me kind of. now I'm leaning back leaning right and I can it, it really feels that way even with like especially with the VR it, where you can look a little bit around like the, the FOV is not that great and resolution to be honest is not that great with the um, Oculus DK2, I'm not sure if it might be better with new ones, I, I bet it will be, but I've been up sampling already, and uh, yeah, I can live with it for now, but the, the possibility it brings, like looking in the, into the Apex and stuff, it's really nice. Also looking at the bike, right? <laughs> And very, very immersive crashing, of course. That's very nice as well. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna look at the track once, and then try to get a fast lap that I'm gonna put into replay maybe at the end of this. Because this, of course, has a replay option as well, like a replay mode kind of, which is very nice. I'm gonna show you in a second. So this corner right here, I struggle with hard. Going around it in the beginning, speed is way down already. And then I go way too fast on this <laughs> most of the time. So what I've been trying to do is break here and lean in. And now I'm going a little bit extra slow kind of. I'm gonna try a fast lap but it's probably gonna fail horribly. Okay, this section I really like, but it's a little misleading to me because right here is a very sharp corner 
where I used to crash all the time and still do on occasion. Okay. Oh, and by the way, there's dirt on the visor now, so I can use the tear off. <laughs> Comes with a little animation, very cool. Okay, there you go. And break hard. Oh no. Okay. I've got my problems with this one as well. It's it's kind of different from driving a saddle <laughs> the way that you you're on a bike, <laughs> leaning in and stuff and anticipating the corners, very difficult. And I'm very happy that I can, after practicing for a week or so, I can get, at least get around this without crashing constantly. And I've been feeling the speed a little bit already. It's very nice. Um, yeah, this section right here, interesting because it's a double bridge kind of. And I like this corner right here. It's very cool because it has some bumps in the road. Here you can see, oh yeah, bumpy bumpy, and here as well, very nice, makes for interesting cornering, and this corner I had my problems with as well, but now it's like more of going going through it like with a hard lean, <laughs> long one and crash, oh, ow, okay, yeah, that was dumb, but um, it's a very long one, and normally you just lean in, and it's good. It's good. Okay. So there's a bridge again with kind of a sharp corner, a lot of leaning forward on the bike, and this one is interesting. It made me crash so often because it's such a sudden corner. And then back on the finish line, there's the pit, uh, pit entrance. And now I'm gonna try to go a little faster. And this is also very misleading, like, it looks like you've end this time, but no. Not good. Let's do this in a second. Slow, I think. Yep. I mean, this will never be my best speed right here. Still all practice, but it will be very nice to go around this very fast. <laughs> Bike lifted up a little. Okay. Oh no, no, not again! Not again! Ah, and there goes my bike. Okay, here we go. Let's try to get a semi-fast one. With second gear for the tie corners. Not first, as I always do. I think I'm losing speed there then.
Oh no, first again. Yeah, it's because I'm too high with my speed going into into the corner, I think. Feels way more fluid with the second gear. Just need to brake earlier. Yeah. Oh yes. Oh yeah, even third. Cool. Ah, uh, too early. Mm. Missed the gear. Let's try this in third. using the uh, rear brake oh in fourth no at least third should be should be it for this corner, I think. All right, let's see if we can do one more. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> and a little slide in the end. <sighs> yeah, but I'm gonna keep practicing. <laughs> so that is that. I'm <laughs> gonna attach the replay of the last lap just for the fun of it and uh, yeah thanks for watching bye bye